So now our objective is to minimize our total cost function, which is equal to AK over Q plus AC plus HQ over 2. And how do we do this? We obviously need to derive. So we need to get the derivative of our total cost with respect to Q. This is uh, negative AK over Q squared. This is a constant, so plus 0 and then plus H over 2. Um, if you remember your calculus, after getting the first derivative, we equate to 0. And because uh, equating to 0, because we equated this to 0, we will get a Q. Well, imagine this part gets transposed to the right. No? Uh, Q squared goes up, H goes down, 2 goes up, and then get the square root. No? So Q is plus minus the square root of 2AK over H. And because we are dealing with uh, units of inventory, then, then the negative root is extraneous. Okay? Therefore, what we have is a Q, which is equal to square root of 2AK over H. However, however, this Q, which is equal to square root of 2AK over H, is, is just a... Uh, what they call this critical point no because we just got this uh, value of q when we equated this first derivative to zero to know exactly if this critical point is actually a minimum point we need to check the second derivative why because we can use the second derivative test in order to determine if this critical point is in fact a minimum or maximum point. So, we need to get the second derivative. And the second derivative is, uh, well, for this one, we get a 2ak over q cubed. And then th for this one, we, uh, this is 0. And if we substitute q equals square root of 2ak over h into the second derivative, we get a positive number. No? So this is greater than 0, positive number, which means q star equals square root of 2ak over h is a minimum point. Okay? And if you uh, substitute Q star into your total cost function, what do we get? We get an A K all over square root of 2 A K over H plus A C plus H times square root of 2 A K over H times, uh, sorry, Uh, hq over 2 okay so let's fix this first this is an a k times the square root of h over 2 a k and then plus a c plus for this one this is an h over 2 square root of 2 a k over h okay now the reason why I rewrote this this way is because it's easier for us to see uh, the things that we can cancel. We have AK here. We have square root of AK below. So what will happen is we will end up with a square root of AKH over square root of 2. Plus AC for this one. Plus... In this case, we can cancel, uh, we have a square root of 2 on top and 2 below. So this is square root of 2. Your h over square root of h will, will have a square root of h on top. So this is a k h. 
And finally, as you can see, this is the same as this. So this is 2 square root of 2ak, ah, sorry, square root of akh over square root of 2 plus ac. And we can cancel. What we will end up with is a 2, square root of 2akh plus ac. Okay? So, if you input your q star, which is your optimal order quantity, square root of 2ak over h, into your total cost, we get this.